Hey there, everybody. It's me, Kay. What day is it in Minecraft? Uh, it is now day... Where did I find that? It's on here somewhere, isn't it? Day 108, yeah. Nice, day 108. We're uh, more than 100 days into this world. That's pretty cool. Uh, today, it's like... Uh, oh, let's see. I think it's like 6 in the morning. I tried to sleep for a while. I couldn't. I, hi, zombie. Um... No. Go away. Out. Away with you. Okay, cool. Yeah, I couldn't sleep, so I'm up doing my Minecraft episode. Because this is probably the best I'm going to feel today, and I may as well do it. I was laying down... I finally did get some sleep, and then I uh, I just woke up with the worst nausea I was gonna have for a while. Ugh, I still got it. I took a dose of Pepto Bismol, but I'm uh, I'm making it. I'm working on it. We'll uh, we'll get there. It's gonna take me a little while to get better. Ugh, this is gonna be a short episode probably because I'm. I'm not feeling good, and I can barely talk because of the nausea. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's like, one of the real bad bouts is hitting me again. I, uh, I don't have any new advice on how to take care of it if you're dealing with it yourself, but I do want to talk today to anybody who's had to deal with this or other related things just for a little bit, because that's kind of my daily uplift for people who need it. Uh, I am, I am incredibly lucky. In, in dealing with my depression because I have my boyfriend who takes care of me. Some people who are dealing with depression may not have anyone taking care of them. And I just want to say to anybody who has that being the case, you gotta take care of yourself. Now I know that's hard, but believe me, it, I'm just filling this in right now. Uh, I know that's hard because you're depressed. It's like I'm, I'm feeling lousy, but I'm also depressed on top of that because the medication doesn't start working yet. And that kind of sucks, and I agree. You have to you have to take care of yourself, and that means doing whatever it is you gotta do. If you gotta drag yourself out of bed to go take some Pepto Bismol or to make yourself breakfast or something because you gotta eat, then you gotta do that because you don't want to make yourself actually sick on top of thinking you're sick from the medication. And that means you have to take proper care of yourself, and that also means you have to emotionally take proper care of yourself. And that means if you need, you just absolutely need that tub of haagen and you're just going to eat the whole damn thing, then by God, you eat that damn thing. Okay, guys? Because you got to take care of yourself. I know that doesn't feel like taking care of yourself, eating a tub of ice cream necessarily, and you would ostensibly be right. But if you don't have somebody giving you, you know, the hugs, the attention, the time that you would otherwise need, then you just got to do something for yourself. And sometimes that's that's what you can do for yourself, is just eat something that's horribly junk food for you that you shouldn't have. Which I do. I usually have about a small cup of gourmet ice cream every day, in fact. Because I really love good ice cream, and there's no harm in taking care of yourself if you are healthy enough, you know, if you're not diabetic or something, of course, then a small cup of ice cream isn't going to hurt you, even if it's something you do every day. But, yeah, take care of yourself, please. That is the most, just hands down, the most important thing you can do. I'm going to go grab some more dirt from over here. You absolutely have to take proper care of yourself while you're going through your your problems with your medication, because it'll get better. And my big problem was I just couldn't sleep. This time it was because I was too nauseous, but the medication also gives me insomnia, which will, again, go away. It's just something I have to wait through. Let me just put a little more of this in my inventory. I think I have enough with this block. I might have one more than I need. But please, yeah, do watch out for yourself while you're dealing with this. 
there's a lot you have to worry about with medication, like taking most antidepressants. Antidepressants. That's where you don't get a Christmas. No, antidepressants. With most antidepressants, you don't. Uh, there's there's very little lifestyle change you have to do. I know you can't drink alcoholic beverages anymore if you take alcohol. Uh, if you take antidepressants, because you can have a really bad reaction with that. But uh, but there's not a lot of lifestyle changes that are permanent that you have to worry about. I'm gonna put my path down here. And I hope that these daily kind of vlog-like things are a good good thing for people. I know I have a viewer who struggles with depression really bad and is now taking the medication, and I know they're helping him, so I would keep doing them even if they helped no one else. But I do hope that they're a help to other people because, boy, they're, they're actually kind of a help to me. It's nice to get to do something every day. Okay, I'm going to put this right here. And then you can just hop right there. Okay. If I put that there, though, I could get access more directly here. So I'm going to do it this way. And I'm going to knock this block out. And this block out. And there we have it. Oh, I'm glad I brought this. There we go. I had the foresight to bring a, uh, a bucket of water, just in case I did something like that to myself. Ugh, I don't know if this incredibly dry mouth I have is a side effect, or just a side effect of being nauseous and taking the Pepto-Bismol and then drinking and insure and everything that I do when I'm nauseous. But I hope that goes away, because that's really annoying. I hate dry mouth. Let me just eat this zombie flesh that I happen to have lying around, and get my glowstone... Because I'm going to light these up with a glowstone block in the middle of each. There we go. And that's how you get to my little base now. You don't have to swim out here every time. These pillars I'm going to do some stuff with. First of all, let me just build up here because I need to get set up to do the roof. There we go. No. I'm not I'm kind of like freehand in the roof right now cuz I don't know what I want to do exactly with it. Okay, I'm going to have to put in something there otherwise it doesn't structurally work. No, I don't like those here. I'm going to actually put torches in this area. Torches would look better. And I need more of this. So let's get that. Sorry if I'm a little quiet. I'm, I'm having trouble projecting, and I don't want to wake my boyfriend up, who is still very much asleep. There we go. I wish I could go back to sleep. I've got stuff i got to do today. But there we go. And that is correct. What is going on with this? Oh, 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 it's it's one too many on this side. Okay. Also, I just want to say to... Uh, I've, I've had several people that are like, Hey, check out my channel and stuff. I want you to look at it. I will do that when I'm, I'm not quite so unwell. I just need a little time first to get better so that I can provide some kind of valid critique and be, you know, useful. Okay, so that goes under it. Yes. Did I do that? No. Okay, there we go. And this one I will damage a little bit.
Got to get on top of it so that I can put the the blocks on it. There we go. Oh, what did I even do over there? Oh, crap. No, 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 no. That, that is a no-go right there. There we go. <laughs> Had to fix that. Did that a little bit wrong. Okay, and... There we go. I'm going to put torches up in this area. But for now, let's get the heck out of here. I got plenty of bread so I can afford to sprint. Oop. Get back to my house. Oh, that tree's in the way. It's going to have to go. Oh, hi there. Hello. I got zombies coming. Hopefully I can get in bed before they get too close. Will they let me sleep? Yes, they will. Thank goodness. Let's go to... Hi there, guys. You were coming for me, weren't you? Ow. Out you go, zombies. No undead allowed, please. Thank you. Oh, I'm just eat you, zombies. You'd do the same to me, so it seems fair. Holy cow, did I just eat three of those in a row without hunger? Wow, that is mathematically unlikely. <laughs> Holy crap, that's pretty cool. Okay, my uh, my dry mouth is just way too bad at this point, and I am still really nauseous. So I'm going to end the recording here. I will get some torches on there next time and finally start migrating stuff out of here to there. I'm gesturing with my hands right now, and you can't see that. So I apologize. I will see you guys tomorrow on Monday. It'll be day eight, and hopefully I'll be doing better then. Goodbye for now, everybody.